Councilman Zeke Cohen calls the police response excessive. Local residents are alarmed. The loud helicopters, low uh, spotlights, and then the loudspeakers. Foxtrot took to the sky asking kids to get out of the pool for their safety, saying no lifeguard is on duty. Police say kids entered the Patterson Park pool after hours. Police Commissioner Michael Harrison says their helicopters fly over the city pools every day to check on them. And what we know is that that pool was successfully closed at 6.30 p.m., but at some point, young people climbed over the fence. We have evidence of that, entered the pool, helicopter spotted it, called it out. I wish they stopped before someone seriously get hurt, and that's the part I'm worried about. Mm -hmm. Somebody's child drowned in that pool, and nobody's here to save them mm -hmm. because they want to go for a nice swim. I mean, I understand, but... I, will, I don't want other people's kids getting hurt. Councilman Zeke Cohen tweeted this Thursday night, I've asked BPD not to use their helicopter to chase away kids at the pool repeatedly. While I do worry about the safety of children swimming at night without a lifeguard, this ain't it. Totally excessive. I'm meeting with BPD and Rec and Park next week and plan to address this. Parks and Rec released a statement in part saying there's been an uptick of misconduct at several pool locations, including threats to staff, vandalism, and an overall disregard for pool rules. They say the behavior can lead to closures. Lisa Robinson, WBAL, TV 11 News.